Hey guys, it's me Abby. So today I'm doing a chit chat getting right with me. I got actually a lot to talk about. <laughs> like, usually these chit chat getting right with me is like I don't have very much to talk about, but kind of a lot to talk about. So, hey guys, I know. Hi, this is um future Abby. I'm uh, editing this video right now. TBT20 used to do uh, YouTube videos on this cam on the webcam. Oh my god. So I just want to let you guys know I forgot to mention something in the video. Um. I actually have a new channel, I know you're thinking like, oh my god, I have so many channels. Okay, I have like three, okay. It's a channel with my, like, one of my best friends, Jillian, I don't think I remember her, aka Gerardo. Um, basically, she's, me and her created a channel together, and we have two videos up. Well, one of them is introduction video, and then we have a yoga challenge. It's actually really gotten, like, really popular in the past, like, a week or two. You should go check it out. I'm going to leave the link to the channel down below so you guys can go subscribe to it and request videos. I don't know why I forgot to mention that in this video because I was planning to. I'm just let you guys carry on with the rest of the video and I will talk to you guys in a second with um pastime Abby. Uh, I'm just gonna start with my eye primer like usual. You know. Get a little closer. topic that I want to talk about with you guys that I was in the hospital yeah last night and I know you guys are like freaking out maybe you're not maybe you're just like what the hell happened okay so basically okay this is like the most randomest time ever I went downstairs to pick up laundry from the dryer went back up to my room put down the basket just kind of sat there for you know, like a minute just like doing whatever and then I noticed that my chest started to hurt on my right side, and um, it was getting hard for me to breathe. Whew. I'm still not like back to normal, like just talking that much. Can I get out of breath? Um, I started to like gasp for air, and I ran downstairs. I told my dad about this. He tried. He called like we paged my doctor. She told me to just go to the ER. So we drove to the ER. My, my dad and my uncle drove me to the ER, and I was in the back, in the front seat, just gasping and like holding my chest. And I started to feel, like really lightheaded, like I could barely walk because I felt like I was gonna pass out. So we went to the ER. My mom met us up there, and the thing that made me really mad was that they made us wait in the waiting room for about 45 minutes to almost an hour while I was gasping for air people okay there's people who are just coming into the hospital with like a broken foot or their babies like a little fever or something and they have to go straight in but there was me on the side gasping for air barely being able to breathe I was like freaking I was getting so mad and emotional I was a hot mess so Oh, I'm sorry, I, I, I'm using this NYX single eyeshadow in the color Fancy That Seduction. It's like a really like pretty goldish pink color. Um, so we, I, we were literally just waiting there forever. My parents complained that like, my daughter cannot freaking breathe. Is there someone that can take her like right now? And people were like yelling at my parents because they're like, oh, um, it's a full house. We're trying to get every co everybody caught up. I'm like... Finally, after like 45 minutes to an hour, they take me in into this, oh, no, like this doctor guy takes my blood pressure. It's like a little bit low. Wheeled me to like a room. Oh my, I was so like at that point. I, I was like, I got up from my wheelchair and I like slammed back down because I could not like keep myself still. They took an EKG on me, which basically means like they like check your heart and stuff so my parents left the room the woman put like stickers stuff on my chest and my ankles and connected like cords to the computer so they could like check my heart my heart rate and stuff so when she was done that she left and then my dad and my mom came in again and they kind of just like we waited there for maybe an hour during the waiting time i fell asleep and i took a nap and I woke up disturbed. They're like, oh, you gotta wake up. They have to wheel you in, into another room. And I was, and I, I could breathe better. I was still a bit lightheaded. Um, but I think when I fell asleep, it like regulated my breathing. Then, oh my God, so much drama happened yesterday. My mom was being like really pissed off because um, basically they woke me up from the other room to take me to another room and wait another like 45 minutes. So we had to wait again. And then finally the doctor came in. 
and she's like asked me questions and stuff like that. She checked like my um my, my breathing or my heart or something. Like ugh. I I like to like I take like deep breaths and like she put like the stuff a stethoscope on my chest and whatever. I'm gonna use my naked palette. And I'm gonna use the color naked. Okay. So my mom was just like, oh, do you have any um information information about the EKG? You know, for my heart and stuff. And she said, I didn't know you took an EKG. And my mom was like, how do you not know that she took an EKG when they're supposed to send you the report to you? And of course, she's like, oh, let me go check. So she left. We waited there even longer for, for, for her ass to come back. And then she came back. She's like, everything seems to be fine. And then we're like, we're not going to like talk about her. Yeah, and we left. It was, it was about... One, it was almost 2 o'clock in the morning that we actually got to leave and we, we got there around like 10.30 ish yeah 10.30, 10.45 ish so I, I was there for about 4 hours I'm gonna use the color um, uh, 13 in my brow bone like I didn't really find out anything and we were waiting for so long and my mom was being like really like she was complaining a lot and her stress made me stress, and so there was just a lot of like domino effect happening. Take the color Dirty Sweet in this palette, and I'm going to apply this in my inner corners. I want to use the color Whiskey, and I'm just going to apply this on my lower lash line. So I'm basically done the eyeshadow. I didn't want to do anything like crazy. I'm just going to someone's house today to work on a school project. I know, so exciting. I'm gonna take the color Black Market, which is the very middle color. And I'm going to use this as a um. Oh my god, Abby, you never finish your sentences. I use that eyeshadow for eyeliner. I'm sorry, I always do that. Bless your soul, I'm sorry. Okay. And future Abby, she's making a lot of comments today. Now I'm going to use my mascaras, and I'm using my L'Oreal Shocking Extensions Mascara, telescopic one, and my Benefit Royal Lash. I'm going to do that, and I'll come right back, because I take forever to do my mascara. Now I'm just going to fill my brows with the color Whiskey. And black market and mix those two together. And I'm just gonna, like lightly fill my brows. I decided I kind of like make them. I don't know. I think this brush is too thick because it applies too much product. So then I'm gonna use this brush instead. It's like a thinner brush. I've had, been having some like boy drama. I'm not gonna explain the whole thing because it's too much to explain and. Kind of personal stuff, I guess. Not like personal, but just like don't want, don't really want to like talk about it. I'm going to my third week of high school, and I'm already dealing with boy drama. Like what? No, that 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 is not supposed to happen. I haven't used my NYX palette in a little while, powder at least. So I'm gonna use the NYX palette and use the yellow color. My friends were laughing at me that I, that I've been using the yellow color a lot because I and like Asians are like are. You don't feel like yellow. Don't want to be racist if you're Asian, but like that's what people like call me like yellow because since, since I'm Asian, and like since I've been using a lot of the yellow color like all of my face, they start like laughing. Like, oh, like that, that matches your skin. And yeah, my my friends can be annoying. Um, I've also been getting like oily lately. Like I don't understand like why I'm being so oily, but I have, and it's ridiculous. Okay, now I'm going to put my bronzer real quick. NYX, um, not, not, not NYX, um, NYC Smooth Skin just to make me look a little more tan. And the last thing I'm going to do is just apply some blush. NYX blush, you know, the usual. I'm trying to film and they're being a little bit rude. Okay, so that's basically my finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this, like, this chit chat game right with me. Um, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye! Yeah.